you know, censorship, you have to censor yourself for a certain subject. For example, religion. In Senegal, it's difficult for me to talk about religion. I have a lot of critics about religion in my country, but uh, I don't want to shock people. And I decide to not to talk about certain subjects. Because for me, it's more difficult to talk about it than to talk about, you know, a politician. <laughs> Even though the politician got a weapon, for me, it's easier to attack frontalement a politician than to attack uh, somebody on his faith. So, religion is a subject. And today, there's another subject that is kind of taboo. Is uh, come on, about us, homosexual. Mm, yeah. yeah, nobody want to talk about it mm. because you know they think, oh, how, how it be? Religion and sexuality is difficult to talk about it. But uh, yeah, that that's for me the most. I censor myself. I will not talk about sexuality and uh, religion because mm. it's too complicated. When it's when it touch when talk about religion, people get crazy. Mm. Is it easier today to address issues of uh, wife beatings, or is that also still taboo? Yeah, no, no, it's not anymore taboo. Uh, if you touch a woman, you have serious trouble. No, 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 this is not anymore taboo. Women, uh, I can say, they are free now. We had uh, in Senegal uh, a prime minister, she was a woman, so... Yeah, we have respect and we have parity on the come on, assembly national on the mm, come on, national, national assembly. National assembly. No, no, the right of the women are respected mm. in in my country. I will not say that it's the case in all the countries, but in Senegal, yes. Mm. In Senegal, you cannot talk about the marabou, mm. the religion. Uh, if not, mm. you know, you'd get in trouble. But uh, it's a serious case. Um, yeah, that's the most dangerous thing to talk about. What would you say are the, the biggest dangers for free speech at the moment in, in, in West Africa? You could, uh, the biggest danger for freedom of speech is not only in the war zone like in Mali, but when you go to Guinea-Bissau, they're not allowed to talk. When you go to the Gambia, they're not allowed to talk. When you, you go to Ivory Coast, you know, even if the war is finished, but the artists themselves today are obliged, are forced in a certain way to uh, sing for the system, sing for the president, even if they don't want, just to have a living. And there's no copyrights, law, nothing. So, and when they try to do the contrary, something bad can happen to them quickly. Uh, I think Mali is not the worst. Mali is not the worst, even with the Islamists, even with the war. Mali is not the worst. You have certain areas, uh, nobody have the right to talk. And uh, we need to stand up for all these colleagues that they need us 